Yeah, please, go ahead. Thank you, Mr. President. Um, earlier today, the Vice President urged governors to have all their nursing home residents tested. Why not just mandate that? Why not require that? Have you considered that? Well, I, I would certainly consider that. I will mandate it if you'd like. I would. I think it's important to do, and I think, frankly, some of the governors were very lax with respect to nursing homes. It was obvious right from the beginning, the state of Washington, where 26 or 28 people died very early on. And I would have said nursing homes. And I did say nursing homes. That's what they should. Now, some of the states, many of the states are doing that. But I think all of the states should be. They have the capacity to do it. They should be doing nursing home. That is a real vulnerability. The two uh, staffers that were announced last week as testing positive, are you aware of any additional White House staff? No, is, not at all. Uh, I'm only aware of people that saw them were tested. The tests were negative, And they're quarantining anyway. So please, go ahead. Thank you, Mr. President. Um, I wanted to ask, are you now or are you considering separating some more with Vice President Prince as a precautionary measure? Well, first of all, the job he's done on task force, the job he's done, frankly, as the Vice President of the United States has been outstanding. And he's a warrior, too, just like doctors and nurses. I mean, he is working so hard, and he, he's coming into contact with a lot of people. But again, he tested negative, so we have to understand that. But he comes into contact with a lot of people. Uh, it's something probably during this quarantine period we'll probably talk about. I have not seen him since then. But I would say that he will uh, — he and I will be talking about that. Yeah, we can talk on the phone. Question for uh, Admiral Sarar, if I could. Uh, the President just said that Dr. Fauci, Dr. Hahn uh, have tested negative then why do they need to be isolating? Is there some concern that they could be spreading the virus in some way? Is there a concern about the testing? Why do they need to isolate? So this is a very fundamental concept, and I'm so happy you brought that up, because um, it underlies a lot of the questions here. If you test negative just at that one point, that just means you've tested negative for that point in time. We know that the incubation period for this virus can be many days. So the CDC guidelines really says that if you're in close contact, um, just testing negative on that one day doesn't mean you won't be positive later on. So the prudent and the recommended thing to do is to self-isolate yourself for the entire period of incubation and really then some. So that's what they're doing. It's a precautionary manner because they were negative. Uh, we all hope that they remain negative, but if they turned positive in a day or two or became symptomatic, that's still possible, even with a negative.